Hello foodies! Welcome back to my channel. This is Irene and you're watching Eat, Pray, and Eat More. Do you still remember this, this one? Someone throw you avocado and lime? Make guacamole, yes. It's another Taco Tuesday. But this time, we're gonna make it longer. Okay, I know, I know, you're gonna tell me, oh my God, I thought it's an easy, easier one. But for me, may mga bagay tayo na mas masarap anihin pag pinaghirapan at mas mahaba. Don't mo test if you have that patience. Patience is a virtue ikanga. This time, we're gonna make the tortilla from scratch. So it's gonna be a little bit longer. And this time, we're gonna use shrimp instead of chicken for our filling. Come on, come and join me. So now let's start. We're gonna have three cups of flour. We're gonna make now the tortilla. You have three cups of flour. And then one teaspoon of salt. One teaspoon of salt and then one teaspoon of baking powder. I'm gonna mix it like this. Okay. I'm gonna mix the dry ingredients. We're gonna make a well in the center. Then we're gonna put one third cup of olive oil. One third cup of olive oil. And one cup of warm water. Okay. Then we're gonna mix all together the ingredients. Gonna mix it like this. For the tortilla, tortilla, you can use it on burritos, tacos, and also I think it's the same mixture if you want to uh, the, uh, for the wrap, like shawarma. So the same bread you can use uh, also. Uh, same wrap you can use it. So there's so many uh, ingredients. I mean, like you can make different dishes using the same uh, tortilla wrap so so we're gonna put it here now i'm gonna make gonna do it like this Everything is patience. <laughs> Everything needs patience. You know. gonna be like this it's around six inches okay so we'll try to put it in the pan okay so we're gonna cook now our tortilla so it's gonna be like that make the pan hot So it's better, the thinner the better, you know, when you make the, it's better if it's thinner. So now we're gonna cook the shrimp, the filling of the 
tacho. So we're gonna put some oil in the pan. Then we're gonna put the shrimp. more shrimps today, <laughs> baby shrimp, but actually uh, medium sized shrimp would be better, but these are so so small, so yeah, we're gonna put like that, we're gonna put also some paprika, some salt, Put also lemon juice, little one, please. We're just gonna cook it, cook the shrimp. It's kind of small ones, <laughs> but it's okay. Still shrimp. It's still shrimp. By the way guys, if you like this video, don't forget to click the like button. And also for those who are new in this channel, please, please, please click the subscribe button. I really appreciate um, if you could subscribe to my channel and so that you will be also updated on all my episodes coming. I really appreciate it. So now we finished, uh, we already cooked the shrimp. We're gonna make now the filling. So we have now the tortilla here. And then we have the cooked shrimp. And then we have also chopped red onions. We have, of course, uh, uh, we have the avocado. But this one I already mashed it. Mashed avocado. And we have sour cream and chopped tomatoes here. So for me, for now, I uh, will just add uh, some sour cream already on the uh, avocado. So we'll just put uh, the sour cream and the avocado direct to the avocado now. And then, just do it like this. And we're gonna put some little bit of paprika and the guacamole and of course uh, some salt to taste all right so we can put like that so we'll try now the finished product so i have the tortilla here and we're gonna put some shrimp we can put the shrimp inside We're gonna put also some onions. Some onions. And then some tomatoes. And our guacamole. The more the guacamole, the better. You know, I love avocado. It's very healthy also. Okay, so we're gonna taste now. So, this is the final product. Mm. Oh my god. It's so good. It's so good. a very good one and that the third day I made <laughs> so good mm. it's the best best one oh my god mm. so good mm. as I've told you the longer the procedure, it's always better because you can you will make it from scratch, so it's so good, you know, rather than buying from the supermarket. But actually, it's okay also to buy from the supermarket. I'm not saying that it's not good. 
but you know when you harvest it's called so-called labor the <laughs> so-called fruit of your labor I don't know what this is mean that but yes it's always good when it's I mean like for me it's very good it's when you uh, harvest the fruits of your labor of your hard work it's glorious you will feel so blessed and grateful always Very good, very good. Oh, so that's it for today's episode. I hope you have enjoyed and you have learned something again. And please comment if you have any recipe or any food that you want me to try or any restaurant that you want me to try so that I can give my opinion about it. Please comment down below. Thank you so much for all my avid followers and subscribers, and of course, welcome to our uh, to my new uh, to the new watchers. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you very much, guys. Um, hope you like this uh, another episode, and I hope you will, I will see you again on my next episode. Again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Subscribe, eat, pray, and eat more. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day ahead. Always remember, food makes life life -er. Bye! Bye-bye!